Jesus Christ. Do you still have that annoying neighbor bird? Also S H H H. Thanks for the parry attempt. Uh, no, actually, my neighbor bird. You know what I did? I was so mad, right? And I was so angry about this bird because it was waking me up every morning. So when you get woken up like that so many times in a row, it becomes like you get crazy. You get so pissed that you start thinking about things like, okay, well, in that case, I'm going to just kill this bird, right? Because it was just driving me crazy, right? But of course, I'm not going to try to kill the bird because, first of all, if I were to try to kill the bird, the bird would somehow figure out a way to kill me. So I'm not going to fuck with birds. Birds are buff, right? <clears throat> so what I decided I would do is I would be completely civilized. Completely civilized. My neighbors, the ones that own the bird that used to uh, wake me up every day, they're like seriously high-level lesbians. The kind that work at Home Depot, you know? Not the kind that you see on the internet, right? The kind that work at Home Depot. Now, they're cool. I've talked to them before. Uh, but the thing is that they're not really fluent in English either. They're, you know, Hispanic. So, instead of being like a uncouth Neanderthal, right, I wrote down on a piece of paper exactly how I felt. I explained how, you know, uh, it really disturbs my sleep. I would appreciate it, you know, if you guys could do something about it. And on top of all that, I knew that back in the day, they used to really hate that I smoked cigarettes because the smoke would go from my house to their house so they didn't like that right and I quit smoking right I quit smoking cigarettes in December of last year so I wrote on the letter by the way PS I quit smoking so you don't have to worry about smoke coming in your windows so I was like super kind in the letter and you know what they did they moved the bird to the other side of the fucking place they have two balconies they moved the bird to the other side so it's never a problem anymore civilized uh, I handled it like a civilized human, and looky, look what we have here. The bird is never an issue. I didn't even have to kill it. You know? So, perfect. Perfect. I handled it like a fucking champ, and now I sleep like a baby. Good shit. That's the way you do it. Even Home Depot lesbians can be reasoned with. They can be reasoned with. You know? Anyway.